Okay, to begin with, your press should be between 375 and 385 degrees. Uh, we keep our press at 385 to allow for any cooling or fluctuations uh, while pressing a great deal of shirts. You want to heat up the bottom pad on your press if you haven't printed in a few hours or if overnight to make sure it's thoroughly preheated. We're going to be printing, this is a 100% cotton t-shirt, so you're going to want to make sure you preheat the shirt up to 15 seconds. We typically go six to eight seconds because for our area that gets the most humidity out of the shirt. Uh, some areas if you're more humid or your humidity is higher, you're going to have to press your garments for maybe even up to 15 seconds to get all the moisture out of them. Okay, I'm going to start out with this print. If you still see steam coming from your shirt after you've pressed it, then that means you haven't got all the moisture out of it. And then you want to lightly rub your transfer. We use a heat eraser or chalkboard eraser. You can get these for right, Staples, Office Depot. Okay. This next transfer we're going to be printing actually has a polyester printable adhesive. It's the same printable adhesive that we use for making our foil transfers. And it's just basically a glue, but this has been coated on the back of it for printing onto polyester garments. So that way it, it adheres. Press these exactly the same as you would all the other transfers. And this shirt's already been preheated, so we didn't have to preheat the other side. You want to lightly rub the surface. As you can see, the colors are bright, no bleed. Okay, the next one is going to be, we're going to print some process color prints that we've manufactured. Here too, she's going to preheat the shirt. Now this is a six color transfer. Actually printed with uh, all process inks and it has a clear base that goes down first and then a white back and with these types of prints you can get millions of colors out of a design out of just six colors Another one I'm going to print is another process print. If you're printing on 50-50 garments, you don't necessarily need to worry about preheating. It doesn't hurt anything to preheat. A lot of people do preheat all their shirts. That way they don't have to worry about pressing one way or the other. This next transfer uh, has some of our fluorescent inks on it. I'll show you how those look on black. Always make sure you lightly wipe the surface of the transfer before peeling it. That way you get all the ink off the paper.